Claire and I are going to have a relationship. Yay! Hooray! <laughs> so um, her and I are going to lean into each other. Give me your hands. Okay. Take some steps back. Okay. We're having a relationship here. And honestly, we kind of depend on each other. You can see that if we let go, one of us is going to come forward. And this is to, this symbolizes our secure attachment style. It's um, reciprocal and both people are giving and receiving. Does that make sense? And what happens if I, oh, <laughs> I'm glad, <laughs> I'm glad you can fall down. Okay, no, come have a relationship with me. I'm serious. Come on, I'll be here. Okay, what's your response, Claire? How are you feeling about that? So each time it's just getting more and more cautious, like, oh, I'm not really gonna lean into this. She's starting to feel really cautious. And so she's kind of, I don't know, maybe I'm going to try. Ooh, I really feel nervous. Okay. That um, represents an ambivalent attachment style where it's associated with par parenting that's inconsistent. So we have inconsistently available parents. And so she's kind of getting nervous. Now, Claire, come have a relationship with me. Put your hands out. Okay, lean forward, step back. Are you really going to do this, Claire? Because I got my hands behind my back. <laughs> it's nothing. Nothing. It's nothing from you. Okay, so what are you going to do? Are you going to throw yourself into that? Try that very much. No. Okay, so she might go, yeah, she's going to her back. I'm not really going to play that game because you're just not there. This represents our avoidant attachment style. And it's associated with consistently unavailable par um, parenting or caregiving. Okay, and usually consistency is a great thing, but not when it's like consistent neglect. <laughs> That's not so great. And so um, in the relationship, Claire gets to where she knows I'm not going to be there, so she's not even going to try. Okay, here's our last one. Put your hands up. Let's have a relationship. <laughs> I feel so bad doing that, but she's <laughs> in her face. She was like, <gasps> what's going on? <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> okay. But do you want to have a relationship with me some more? What are you going to do if this is my constant? She's even right now, she's nervous, OK? She knows, because I, I smacked her, right? It okay. makes me more nervous to yeah. want to come in and engage. OK, now if I was really going to, if I really came at you every time, then there's no way. You might run to the back right. of the room. <laughs> yeah. right. I'm out here, I'm done. OK, go ahead and sit down, thank okay. you. That represents our disorganized attachment style, which is associated with caregiving that's abusive, extremely chaotic, that induces fear in the child, okay? And child's response is gonna be that um, approach avoidance, where they um, have these bizarre behaviors because they're so fearful. And you might see in a child 